So we've got our top four. We have Sean, Mitchell, this person we haven't seen a game from, and Wolfie. We're going to hop into Sean's progress. game right Let's now. All right, whose team do we want to watch from? I want both these guys to win. These are two These are two yeah. of the people I thought would win the tournament. So Golduck leading off against the Kyogre. Ooh. Kyogre victory bell. <laughs> Was that there? We didn't see the victory bell We didn't bell see before. a victory bell. Um... It might have been that. We uh, we came into the game a little late. Victory Bell might be a great Xerneas counter. It's a poison type. Yeah. It could be like a Specs Victory Bell, man. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, you know what? I actually think Kyogre has a definite advantage here. He can get one of these. He can remove one of these players off the board. He can go for the Thunder. He can go for a bunch of stuff. Just kidding. He's going to withdraw into a Zekrom Ooh. to block a Thunder, maybe. Simple Beam. Okay. What the hell? What's that's gonna uh, trip. That's gonna double everything that uh, Geomancy does. <gasps> yeah. Oh, we got Encored! <gasps> oh, holy moly! <laughs> Encored from a victory bell. <laughs> okay. Oh. We got a game on our hands. That's a switch. <laughs> that is... And it was Salamence. He was running Salamence too, man. We didn't see any of these things. There isn't a rule that players can't change their teams in this tournament. Yeah. So we see the sub coming out, obviously. And Simple Beam onto Xerneas, though. That is a play. I, I think that's pretty cool, but I think the Encore Victory Bell. Yeah. This has to just be a Groudon check of some sort. Mm -hmm. Does Xerneas get Psychic? So Xerneas Who would have thought that things. Victory Bell was the best Pokemon in the world. Obviously, it's switching here. Coming uh, in with Metagross. Okay. okay. Can we get that Fusion Bolt off? Okay, Confuse Ray's there. This is pretty close. No Pokemon have been KO'd yet. I think this is one of the longer games we've had without a KO. Yeah, Zernius, for turn four without anything Xerneas is not doing too hot here. Unless we see like an HP Fire or something coming out on the Metagross. It doesn't have great matching versus Metagross. Yeah. Uh, Metagross, I think, is actually going to switch here, though, because it's pretty obvious that Will Wisp is going to be incoming. Or he might just try and protect. Let's see. Sean might try and get lucky. Let's see if he goes for the Meteor Mash. Yeah, he went for he the big... For the, he goes for the nuke into the Xerneas slot. He thought Xerneas might switch, but we see yeah. a Shadow Ball. Wow, it looks like an offensive Shininja instead of just a wall variant. Well, I mean, what what really is a wall Shininja? <laughs> a wall it's, Shininja. The thing's only got one HP. Yeah. I like to see Shadow Ball over things like Shadow Sneak. That way you can't get gimped by, like, uh, yeah. Ferrothorn. He's withdrawing, obviously. You don't want to get confused, baited. And just Dazzling Gleam is going to break a sub. Chunk of Victory Bell. Maybe we'll get to see if Victory was holding, like, Black Sledge. Fusion Bolt's Fusion not going to KO. It's going to chunk it down, though. And note that uh, the... Huh. Let's see. Xerneas is faster than Zekrom. It was last turn. So, I mean, does Sean have any way of KOing a Shedinja? He could Encore it. Yeah, he could Encore it. But, I mean, that doesn't get rid of it. That's true. I mean, his Cresselia might have Psychic, he might have Rock Slide. Uh, he has to expect the Encore this turn. So let's see if Sean goes for it. Protecting while Toxic's not the greatest. Let's just see if he just goes for like a Sludge Bomb or a, a Giga Drain on the Xerneas. That would be, be a good play, too. Gastro Acid! Okay, so suppressing the ability is the plan for the, uh... To KO the Shedinja. Yeah. But it also works really good on Golduck. Because yep. now you can come in with a Kyogre. There's the and Kyogre there's switch the heavy in, rain. But he's switching into a potential Dazzling Gleam. I don't know if I like that. Ice Beam's not going to be good on Metagross. We don't see a Freeze. Moon Blast. Moon Blast. Okay. Mm. That's a big um, chunk. Let's see. It looks like... I mean, Metagross is by far the fastest thing on the board now. Yeah. But you can just switch to Shedinja. <laughs> this board can't hit yeah, it. This, unless there's uh, like, unless he's running something really weird with Metagross. Can Metagross can get Rock Slide, right? Uh, can Metagross get Fire Punch? I doubt it. I it's, don't a think so. it's a Steel type. type. Yeah. What could Kyogre do? I'm going to laugh. They just go like Toxic or something. That's going to be ridiculous. This is still a pretty close game. This is still yeah, close. No is... Pokemon have fainted yet. It's it's dangerous. Yeah. All right. So we're seeing Xerneas switch out. Oh, yeah. There's the Ninja switch that we we called Ice Beam on Kyogre. Not doing a lot. It looks like it's a it looks like it's a Scarf Golduck. As Meteor Mash isn't going to make contact. Thunder will make contact on Golduck, picking okay. up the first KO. So. All right. All right. 
not happen. And we're going to see Salamence yes. come and get that Intimidate out. Salamence get... Oh, remember, and it can also intimidate the metagross because it no longer mm. has clear body. It gains Tough Claws. Yeah. How do you take it out? I mean... We got Ice Beam. Not... Oh, you're talking I'm about, talking the, about the Shedinja? You don't. <laughs> you, uh... Shedinja can KO Metagross from here with Shadow Ball. Oh, you're right. It did about that much last time. So... I mean, maybe. It's really close, but I still think that, like, Kyogre has a power play. I don't know. We'll see. Shedinja has a bunch of tricks. It could also just go for Confuse Ray on Kyogre. Like, protect Mega Evolve Sally with Confuse Ray on Kyogre. That makes a bit of a guessing game. We know Salmons is most likely going to protect. Mm -hmm. So if I were a betting man, I would try to bring in a Pokemon that could take out that Shedinja, or at least force it to not do stuff next turn. Yeah. So Zekrom's going to come okay. in. We don't know anything well, about the Zekrom uh, Can set. Zekrom get past Wonder Guard with uh, Terravolt? Yes. Okay. But so, I don't I don't know if he knows that. So this is a protect. Well, he can also gastro acid, but he needs Victor Bell in a good position because Victor Bell's low. Let's also look at this Salamence is the fastest thing on the board now. Yeah. We know Zekrom's not scarf. And it can go down but Salamence is never pack <laughs> they don't actually pack dragon attacks anymore. <laughs> no, that's all flying all day. But that was VDC twenty fifteen. It might be different now. Yeah. Mega Salam the the way to run your Mega Salamence might have changed. I wonder, though... It, it looks like that Salamence is struggling in this heavy rain a little bit. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I can't stay up. <laughs> it's like, Arr. I think Terravolt lets you hit the Shedinja. Yeah. But we'll see. We'll see how it works. I think, um... It's for... Duh, that's, mm -hmm. that's a bad play. Score's evened up, though. It's time for Metagross to come out. And he was for Toxic. It looks like he thought he might switch. Shedinja just might be out of options. Yeah. Uh, Fusion Bolt is great here because Xerneas is super low. So the way I see it is if you get Shedinja off the board, we don't even know if it has a Sash. Yeah. Well, it could, it's either that or Goggles. It could have a Lumberry. It could. Lumberry is probably better than Goggles in this format. In this format, yeah. Because uh, there's so much say. weather suppression. It could even have a Focus Band. That can <laughs> activate multiple times. Yeah, but that's, a, that's, a, that's too big of a gamble. Could even have a Quick Claw. We have no idea. Bright Powder? <laughs> Draco, he packs the dragon move. Oh. oh, do we see the rock slide, though? Do you get rock slide? Zen headbutt. Oh, man. Things aren't looking good. Oh, oh yeah, that that's game. Range, that's yeah. going to be game. Man. That was a crit, so we don't know if it was within Oh, range. no, it, it was. Yeah, yeah, Sean. Man, that was a nice try. The gastric acid from yeah. Victory Bell. Shedinja. Putting in work. Are we going to have Shedinja yeah. win the first tournament? Would. Yeah, he was hoping for no Draco, too. Mm -hmm. That was a nice try, man. Uh, could, top four out of could, 30 people. Yeah. Could he have uh, hit the Shedinja through his Mold Breaker? I think so. Uh, chat, help me out. Terravolt, does that hit through uh, Does that hit through Wonder Guard? Yeah, I th it should. I think it does. Because um, it makes their ability not matter. Yeah, it, ma it, makes, it makes you hit for like true damage. <laughs> That's <laughs> yeah, why I always like to damage. tell people. All right, so that was the first game of top four. We're going to go into the second game. 